Hello engineers, a big news is coming up from IIT Gandhinagar. IIT Gandhinagar has released the MTech admission portal for the academic year 2025-26. In this video, we will going to discuss about the admission process, eligibility criteria, how you should apply for these MTech courses, what are the different MTech courses, how much stipend is offered. We will going to share the complete detail in this video. But before starting this video, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please do it. Myself Pratik Mishra and I welcome you all to the YouTube platform of IMS Gate Academy. As you can see this, just logging into the official website of IIT Gandhi Nagar, you will find this page where they are accepting the admission applications for MTech program. IIT Gandhi Nagar is offering you the MTech program in Biological Engineering, Chemical Engineering, Civil Engineering, Computer Science and Engineering, Artificial Intelligence, Earth System Science, Electrical Engineering, Integrated Circuit Design and Technology, Mechanical Engineering and Material Engineering. So these are the different MTech courses which are offered by IIT Gandhi Nagar for the academic year 25-26. Let's see ahead. They are mentioning the important dates. So registration has already started from 12th of March and the last date of application is 16th of April 2025 by 5 p.m. Now the thing is, you need to first register yourself into the COAP portal, right? Common Offer Acceptance Portal. This portal, after registering into this portal, COAP registration ID will be generated and using this COAP registration ID, you have to apply here in the IIT Gandhinagar website. You can see here, the eligibility criteria is simple. If you belong to general category, then you should have minimum of 5.5 CGPA or 55% marks in your BE BTEC degree of the relevant field. If you belong to IIT, if you are an IITian, then definitely gate examination will not be required. You can directly apply for the MTech program at IIT Gandhinagar even without any gate score. But the only criteria is, if you belong to IIT, you should have a CGPA above 8. Below 8 CGPA, you must write the gate examination. Above 8 CGPA, you can directly apply for this MTech course at IIT Gandhi Nagar. You can see this. Candidates who have a valid GATE score at the time of interview written exam are eligible to apply for MTech program if is not required for application to PGD IIT program. BTech graduates from IIT with CGPA of 8 and above would be eligible to admission without having appear in gate examination. So if you have 8 and above CGPA and you belong to any of the IITs, then directly you can apply for the MTech program at IIT Gandhinagar. Some relaxation are there for other categories like SCST categories, you have PD categories in the minimum marks, right? Then you can see here, they are calling for the financial support. They are providing you a stipend of 12,400 rupees. And it is officially written in the website that IIT Gandhi Nagar promotes the research. And how they do it, they want their student to do more and more publication. For that, they are providing you with the travel allowance of 60,000 rupees for presenting your papers in national or international conferences. Then you can see this, there are other details also mentioned here. The admission process is simple. First, you have to do your registration into COAP portal. Then you have to come to this website and using that registration ID, you have to register here. Then only your name will be considered for the different counseling rounds which will be conducted for IIT Gandhi Nagar and all the offers will be visible at COAP portal. Let's see ahead what is written. I think this is a very important point here. Usually, IIT Gandhi Nagar does not conduct written exam and interview for MTech selection. But it is totally on their call whether they want to do a written test or interview or not. Last year, all the admissions were happened purely based on the gate score. But if number of applicants are more, IIT Gandhi Nagar has the full right to conduct a short listing written test. This written test will be completely online and followed by an interview. And then the combined score will be prepared for shortlisting the candidates for the MTech courses. But as I told you, last year, the complete selection was based on the GATE score. So basically, this year also we can expect that the selection will be based on the GATE score. But still, if number of applicants are more, IIT Gandhi Nagar reserves the full right to conduct the written test and interview. 
So this is the complete detail about the MTech admission process for IIT Gandhi Nagar. They have launched the portal. Don't forget out to check this. And if you find this information useful, don't forget it to share with your friends. Thank you for watching.